my personal favorite antenna mod of all time, which is the windsurfer, <laughs> which works a lot better when it stays up vertical. Um, now, you may have seen this on YouTube, uh, the video I did a while back actually got put everywhere. So we're not going to go too deep into the discussion of this one. But people laugh at this thing until they make one and they find that it actually does an extraordinary job of boosting uh, your signal. Because basically what it does is concentrates the signal from your router, grabs the signal from your uh, uh, Wi-Fi device in your notebook or your desktop and gives you a pretty healthy, what I've read is 9 to 12 dB boost over the uh, single solitary antenna, the basically the antenna without the parabolic. Making it is super cheap and chances are you can build it with stuff you can already find it around your house. Um, my personal preferred manila folders, file folders, by the way, cheap tools break easy, Randolph. You're going to need a printout, you're going to go to freeantennas.com, the easy 12 template looks like this. You're going to need glue or contact adhesive and the important secret ingredient which would be aluminum foil, recycled preferably. So if you can kind of grok this whole concept, we're going to make a sandwich. We're going to put the template on top of the manila folder or pretty much any kind of cardboard you want to use. And for the backing of the parabola, the actual reflector part, you're going to glue aluminum foil to the back of that. Pretty easy so far. Now you're going to get out forgot to mention these before, scissors or some type of cutting device. You cut the antenna out, you can see where the spaces were, and then you insert the tabs into the slots. All right, these look enormously silly. We mock them, we laugh at them, people point at fingers at them when they're looking at the screen at these being made, but the reality is they often do an awesome job, especially in a house or an office where you have coverage issues. I put this in one corner of my house. We're basically even in the center of the house. We couldn't hit the periphery, and it wasn't a big house. It was a ratty little San Francisco house. And by putting this in the corner and playing around with the directions these were pointed, uh, we actually managed to get excellent uh, coverage, pretty much the maximum speed of the router anywhere in the house. <laughs> 